All right, so let's go over this activity here. So those of you remote, obviously you don't have to have anybody sign your paper, and no one here signed our iPad either because staying safe, right? Six feet. All right, so the date of when Germany invaded Poland. What do we have? What do we have? What year was it anyway? 1939. Good work. Okay. 1939. What month? September. Good work. Good work. So there's many dates people say and give, but we'll just say September 1939. Does that work? Okay. Yeah, there you go. Right in September. Start of September. Okay. Who was the leader of the Soviet Union during World War II? What do we got here? What do we got? Soviet Union. Forney, what do you have? Yep, Joseph Stalin. Good work. What was the name of the plane that dropped the first atomic bomb? Dream. Enola Gay. The Enola Gay. Good work. The Enola Gay. What four countries made up the Allied powers? Kiara, go ahead. Good job. So, the United States, Russia. Soviet Union, England, and France. Okay, there you go. There you go. So those are four main players that we're looking at. All right, what three countries made up the Axis powers? The Axis powers. What do you got, Troy? Germany, Italy, and Japan. Good job. It's the name of the Allied general who devised the D-Day invasion. Lentz? The D-Day invasion. <clears throat> Dwight Eisenhower. Good, good job, Ike. Right, Ike. What's some, uh, what, what, some interesting information or facts that we know about him? And Evil Elizabethville here. Yeah, how cool is that? Right. Yeah. So he had a relation here in Elizabethville, PA. It's pretty neat. Pretty cool stuff. Then he, uh, what, bought a farm in Gettysburg, donated a lot of his money, his time, and resources to try to develop Gettysburg and make sure that it's recognized as the battlefield we know and we can learn a lot of information about it today. Pretty cool stuff. So if you go down to Gettysburg in the museum, they show a section for Ike and how he donated a lot of his time and efforts toward you know, help establishing Gettysburg to what we know as today. Pretty cool stuff. All right, so Japanese cities that were destroyed by the atomic bombs. Bottom, what do you got? Oh, you didn't get that far. Okay, sorry. Jeffrey, you have this one? Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Good job. Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Good move on. Okay. Name of the German general who went by the name Desert Fox. Cool name, Desert Fox. He'd rather go spend time with his wife than help stop the D-Day invasion. Guess he can't blame him for that. I don't know. What do we have for this one, Kira? Yeah, Erwin Rommel. Good job, Erwin Rommel. It was funny. I was helping my brother move, and I found a paper that he wrote in high school about Erwin Rommel. It was funny. Oh, look at this. Pretty cool stuff. Name of the fascist dictator of Italy during World War II. We have Gracie. You didn't get there? Okay. Borny, you have this one? Benito Mussolini. Good job. Benito Mussolini. Good. Benito Mussolini. El Duce, right? Oh, that was his name. That was his name. The name of the Japanese island where the iconic Raising the Flag photo was taken. What do we have here? Kiara? Iwa Jima. Job. Iwa Jima. We'll talk about island hopping and how that was used by the United States to try to push Imperial Japan back to its mainland, its island. 
We good? Can we move on here? All right. So the date of the Japanese attack on Pearl Harbor. Everybody should remember this. Never forget it. I know I definitely said it when it came came about in, in, in American history, too. I know we talked about it. Serene? December 7th, 1941. Good job. December 7th, 1941. Ain't that a little infamy, right? Yeah. No. All right, so the name of the seven presidents of the United States that served in World War II. I know this one's a little hard. What's one of them here? What's one of them? Lent? JFK, good job. Troy? Johnson, good job. LBJ? Jeffrey? Nixon, good. Serene? Reagan. Reagan, good. Forney, got one? Eisenhower, yeah, good. All right. Another one? Autumn, do you have another one? No? Kira, you have one? No? What about you, Gracie? H.W. Bush, good work. Nice. George H.W. Bush. Uh, I don't know if we're we missing one here. Ford. Ford, good work. Is there another one or not? Do we say JFK? Okay, all right. There we go. Good job. Good job. LBJ received the Silver Star. How cool is that? That's that's some interesting stuff. Okay, any questions on that at all? Serene. Okay, so make sure you save that. Turn it in so I give you credit for it. And, hey, that's a lot more points already. What? That's 20 points already at the start of the semester. Good start. All right, that's all I got for today.